Hello everyone, welcome back to part 3 in our FIFA 22 career mode. Let's see how we progress in our season into League 1 and hopefully see if we can get into the championship. Let's go. This is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non-stop hype all week long and now for the action. Hello everyone, great to have you with us. This is the scene here at the Stadium of Light. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from League One. It is Sunderland and they face Wickham Wanderers. Thanks Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly. Pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. Number 13, Luke O'Neill. Number 77, Patrick Roberts. Number 21, Alex. And the game Dixon. begins. Well, the attack looks promising. But they dealt with the threat first. Possession changes hands, the interception there. I think you've got to conclude that was good refereeing. A free kick in the end after initially playing advantage, but it just wasn't there. Effective challenge. Room to roam on the wing. And a chance to whip it in here. Real chance. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Playing it in. Able to clear the danger. Corner kick, though, here. Trying to pick out a teammate. And he clears the danger. continues his run gives it a go and a goal that is a very bright start perfect way to open well let's have another look because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved they've played really well so far Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Over the touchline for a throw-in. Alex Pritchard. And there's the feed into the box. Well, in fact, a bit too close to the goalkeeper. And that was always going to be claimed. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Really good interception. Corey Evans. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Thompson. Losing possession. Can they create something from here? Roberts. It might be. Oh dear, not a great effort, was it?
Onaya. Won it back. Well read to ease the pressure. Well, there you can see it. The visitors haven't been able to control possession, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Doing well to keep possession. Not the pass he had in mind. Hogan. Jason McCarthy. Now moving the ball impressively here. He thwarted the attack illegally. Now perhaps a card is forthcoming. Well deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. kick but no goal at the end of it yeah it's a great strike but he just couldn't squeeze it inside the post so unlucky Luke Onayan on the ball Pritchard well couldn't keep it well the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board Doyle. That is that for the first half here. Two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Gabe read it magnificently and intercepted. Stewart. Is it going to end up being productive for them? And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. And it goes! The leveller! Thrilling stuff here! Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Getting the better of his opponent. And can they prize them open now? It looks promising. And a body in the way. And unable to keep the ball. Perfect challenge. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. And the news confirmed before the game, Manchester City have finally got their man, Stuart. Well, it's an exciting transfer, isn't it? He'll add a lot of quality to his new club, and you'd expect him to have an impact straight away. Good player and fair value for him, I think. Well, a chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. Substitution time it is. And now the delivery. Well, it has come to nothing. Jack Clark. Doyle. Danny Batt on the ball Pritchard and a fine tackle there's a slide draw pass but 
he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. This is a message for Andy Tottenham. That's Andy Tottenham. Can you oh, moving it nicely. Andy Tottenham, thank you. We wonder who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. Well, these fans are pushing their team on here. They sense a winner's coming. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Flag up, tight offside. And the substitution will occur now. Ten minutes to go then. Regain possession. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. A fine block. Well, the fans are making so much noise here. They believe the winner's coming, but it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. Can he finish? Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Rifled against the post, but back in play. Oh, fine save, and it remains all square. Well, he saved his team there. That's a big moment for the keeper. Played over, and he clears the danger. Oh, good-looking run. Still alive. Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. Roberts. And with that, the referee brings this contest to an end. All square here in what was a thoroughly compelling game. Stuart, your analysis. Well, it could have gone either way. I thought both teams were very positive, though, going hammer and tongs from the very start. And I think a draw is probably the fair result.
all eyes on one man. He scored four in his last three. What will he produce today? Stay with us on EA TV. Hello everyone, the weather forecaster has promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner as usual is Stuart Robson and all about action from League One coming right up. It's Wickham Wanderers and they take on Ipswich Town. Well Derek, when looking forward to this game you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And a goal kick is the outcome. Well, it is without question a very special day. This his debut match. Stuart, what should we expect to see from him? Well, I'd be looking at his positional play today. Is he going to make the right decisions when to tuck in, when to get tight to his winger, and when to pass players on? If he gets those right, he'll have a good game because on the ball, he's an excellent talent. That continues his run. A chance to whip it in. Now let's see about the cross. Not all that convincing defensively. And off target by Miles with that one. And a goal kick will ensue. Well, he really is danger personified. But in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, he's had a terrific start to the season, hasn't he? He's been so lethal in front of goal. And while there's still a long way to go, he's very much on target to break the scoring record. Don't be too surprised if he notches another couple here today. He's going forward well here. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. And back with Harris. Well, great read there to intercept. Sam Morsi. Harris. Selina. Every pass hitting its target. Oh, excellent diving stop. Short corner favoured. Targets available. Cross comes in. He succeeds in clearing it. High quality defending. And he could really get at the opposition. Oh, a vital interception. Can he finish? And a goal! To open the scoring, no wonder they're celebrating. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect goalkeepers to save everything at their near post, but on this occasion, although it's a good strike, he should do better. So, underway again here, 1 0 to score. Disappointing pass. Sam Morsi. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Oh, they're, oh, they're in here, Derek. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. And over it comes. A really meat and drink to the keeper under the circumstances. And he's got the beating of his opponent, and he's through here. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. And he's fired over the corner, foiling them effectively.
But he could run onto it here. Terrific save. Well, that's a top-class save. He read it so well. Well, over the top, but it will go through to the keeper. Vincent Young. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. That's a well-struck pass. That is that for the first half here. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. And now with Thompson. At times they make passing look easy. Well, it came to nothing in the end. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Could cross it in here. Able to deal with the threat. Well, this has been widely reported on social media and in the newspapers. And now official confirmation has been received. Lucas Hernandez has completed his move to Arsenal. Well, the reported fee of around £55 million pounds is, in my view... Oh, they could be in here, Stuart! And touched onto the frame of the goal. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. Selina. Thompson. Sam Morsi. So, a half an hour remaining. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Sam Morsi. Well read to ease the pressure. There's a slide rule pass. Must score. Still a chance. And in! Second time of asking, but the goalkeeper badly at fault. Well, here it is again, and I don't think it's good enough from the goalkeeper. You have to say that. He spilled it right into the danger zone, and at this level, you're always going to be punished. Well, a second goal for them here. Coming off the pitch, number 22, Nick Freeman. Coming onto the pitch, number 16, Soleil KK. Thompson. Well, the visitors have controlled possession, as you can see, but their attacking play hasn't been good enough so far. It's been too many safe passes and no real penetration. They certainly this need to up the tempo Adriano, if they're going to get back into this one. Happy birthday, Adriano, and have a fantastic day from your friends Rachel Armstrong and Matthew. chance it's opened up for him and a goal that's his brace they just can't keep him quiet well here's another look and you can see what a good finish this is he holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure that's a great goal well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. And now, passing it through, and just has to remain calm. It might be. Oh, keeper in control. 
Well, just a yellow card, and you can see what they think of that decision, Stuart. Well, did he stop a goal-scoring opportunity? I'm with the referee. I'm not sure it was clear-cut. Well, not on the target. Space was at a premium, though. Well, he needs to be careful here. And that's a very good parry. And he might be through here. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. Well taken away. He won the ball. Can they convert? And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Oh, goodness me. He's crashed it against the woodwork. Well, it's so difficult to get that on target. He's done fantastically well. He can count himself unlucky there. Vincent Young, Evans, and Chaplin has it, and we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here, Connor Chaplin, Harris, and there goes the final whistle, and the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Not all that convincing defensively. Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a 10... ...packed occasion. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Hello, everyone, and welcome. What we can't complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And coming up for you very shortly, live action from League One. It's Oxford United, and they face Wickham Wanderers. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality. Some interesting matchup. And that's sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. Well, they've started the game really brightly here, and they've looked dangerous. But that was a top-class save from the keeper. Brilliant from him. Takes aim! And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. And as the caption shows, the visitors come into today's game leading the league in goals four. The best attack in the league statistically. Well, their build-up play away from home has been brilliant. They get the ball into the front players with quality. They get midfield players making runs beyond the strikers. And the full-backs are always ready to overlap. I'm sure we'll see the same again today. 
But on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Well, some pretty big news coming through from one of the other games. Let's hear about it from Alex Scott. Yes, it was a penalty for Cheltenham Town. And he's going to be kick. Must take the lead here. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Well, no damage done. Well, the keeper's made a good save, but you just sense a goal is coming soon. Still passing it around with authority. Just couldn't play that decisive ball. Delightful pass. Well, no stopping him. And the danger clear. Sykes. And Seddon. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Top class defending. Pick out a teammate. Getting in there to take it away. Well, a good tackle. And Seddon. Sykes. They just cannot seem to keep possession today. But well, he's got past his man. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. And he can't be surprised. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. And the danger's still on. Mosinho. Forward. Strong but fair tackle. McCleary. Sterling. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. To take the lead. And there is the goal that gives them a well merited lead. It had been coming. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? And we will have just one additional minute. Baldock. And Seddon. Shot attempted. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Now the delivery, making sure nothing untoward happened. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. And he's made headway. 
and offside by a very small margin. Sykes. Possession changes hands, the interception there. Well, Leicester fans have been wondering, would the deal go through? It is now... Oh, what a chance. This is Derek. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. And a second goal for them here. And Seddon. Elliot Moore. And running it back. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Well, the decision is offside, and he's bound to be a bit disappointed. He's actually made his run before his teammate had control of the ball, and that's why it's offside. Oh, he's given the ball away. This looks threatening. And he's through. Can he finish? And a crucial intervention inside the box. They've got it now, what can they do? A very effective challenge put in. And it crossed the touch line, so a throw in here. Sykes. And it's with Smith. He's given us away. Ford and it's with Smith really getting stuck in making excellent progress with the ball at his feet big chance there it is the goals keep coming no stopping them today well let's see this again the vision to play this through ball is superb, and from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Three goals without reply. Just 20 minutes remaining now. And Wheeler. Oh, good vision. Played into the center. But goalkeeper's ball, disappointingly for them. And Wheeler. Successfully cut out. Almost at full time, and I'll tell you what, playing away from their home patch has been a pleasant experience for them, Stuart. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. Sykes. Defensive efficiency personified. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Chance here. Defensive excellence there. Elliot Moore. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. Long. Hansen. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all round performance.
feel like how what waving out on this pavement in the club like now bro don't be breaking my train A man to watch. He scored four in his last three. What will he produce today? Stay with us on EA TV. Hello, everyone. The weather forecaster has promised us a very pleasant day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And coming up for you very shortly, live action from League One. It's Wickham Wanderers, and they take on Charlton Athletic. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, out... And he's made headway. And he hits it well, but off the post. Goal kick it'll be. Well, news coming through of a penalty in one of the other matches. And Alex Scott can fill us in. Yes, it was a penalty for Shrewsbury Town. Keeper went the right way, but it's hit the post and it's gone in. It's now 1-0 with five minutes play. Many thanks, Alex. And the keeper there to catch it under no real pressure. Eccentric goalkeeping. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger of Ersie. Trying to pick out a teammate. Or just the kind of save every goalkeeper would expect to make. And I don't think Sheffield Wednesday fans are going to be best pleased looking at this particular table. They had designs on something much better. Well, Derek, I expected them to be the team to beat this year, but they just haven't got going. They need to find some form pretty quickly. Well, but tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Horgan. Well, offside here. Such a pity for them. Chance was on. Getting in there to intercept. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Chances on. Useful looking ball. And a goal! Now they've broken through. 1-0 here. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? And the emphasis is on creativity. And let's give credit to the defending. This looks promising. He's taken on his opponent. He's in with a chance. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Washington. And that pass could be troublesome. Well, it looked like a decent avenue of attack, but he couldn't keep himself onside. 
Well, he's just a bit too eager there. All well and good playing on the shoulder, but he just needs to bend his run to stay on side. Dobson. For Stokaski. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Well, in the end, it was rather straightforward for the goalkeeper, Stewart. Well, he has to do better there. That's a really poor finish. Curtis Thompson. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Lecco. For Stokaski. And with that, the first half draws to a close. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Stewart. Joe Jacobson. Freeman. And I must say, that was a very promising attack. The alarm bells were sounding. Well, Chelsea have been busy in the transfer market and the contract situation has been ironed out. We could see him in action pretty soon, Stuart. Well, the figure that's being quoted is around the £35 million mark, which in... Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. And you need your defender to take charge. Adam Nudge. Well, they've given him too much space, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Can he take the chance? Well denied by the keeper, but really he only has himself to blame. Able to skip past his map, and he's through here. And still an opportunity. It's opened up for him. Oh, it was close, but he's put it over. Here it is now, a substitution. He takes it away. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. So a personnel change then. Matthews. Great shot. Opportunity it is. It has to be, surely. And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. A second goal for them here. Chances on. 
surely. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Trying to deliver it accurately and thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. It didn't happen for them. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Well, not enough subtlety about that free kick, I'm afraid. And a fine tackle. Well, it could be on for him here. Superb stop. Just ten minutes remaining here. Bad pass. Jaden Stockley. George Dobson. Jake Forster Kasky. No high quality defending. This might be ideal for the counter. Can they keep it going? A glorious chance. Couldn't grab hold of it. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. And teammates to play it to. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. And opting for the lenient approach, the referee, rather than cautioning him. Clattered away. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Forster Kasky. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Yes, Derek, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park for the most part. And going forward, there were some really nice, incisive plays as well. Good result for them. And he's made headway.